Wonder Brow. Hey, come on, girl. Wonder Brow. Okay, yes, this is the one. Yeah. Yeah, oh my god, I'm so happy with this. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, really sorry I haven't been here in a long time. Uh, my last video was like last year. Okay, don't judge me, alright? I've been busy, man. But look, I promise I'll post a video every week or every two weeks. But yeah, I'll, you'll definitely be seeing more of this face. So, I don't know if you've seen, well, obviously you've seen, but the new craze these days is getting your eyebrows microbladed. Now you've noticed I have, I've got nothing on my eyebrows right now and I look like a thumb. Um, I mean, I can't see the comparison, but yeah. So yeah, so the more hotter the weather gets, the more oilier my, my skin gets, and the more this doesn't work. Now this is my sleek palette kit that I use to do my eyebrows. Not every day, but most days. Um, but my everyday eyebrow use is my sleek pencil. So I literally just da -da -da, da -da -da, fill it in, done. But, I'm, but I've been thinking, you know what, I'm tired of doing that, you know, and I've seen microblading. What it is, for those who don't know yet, it's like they do like little lines like in your eyebrows to kind of make it look like their hairs type of thing. Yeah, so they get the ink to match your um, hair color and whatever. And yeah, it's supposed to last for about two, three years, um, providing you get top ups. And that's something that I've really, 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 really been <laughs> looking to do. But I've been thinking, you know what? It's permanent, do you know what I mean? Okay, semi-permanent, but I'm thinking, look, let me try every other alternative before I get the semi, semi, before I get the semi-permanent tattoo. So that kind of led me on a journey where I was looking online thinking, right, what can I use, what can I use? And then I came across this product, Wonder Brow. Now I know I'm a bit late, I've seen um, Instagram posts like from time to time about oh how great Wonder Brow is and I thought, you know what, it's non-transferable, it's um, waterproof, it's all these things. So I thought, you know what, I'm going to try it. I'm going to try it. What you do, you go online and you have a look at um, all the different colours that might suit you. So this was the one that I think was the closest. Um, my one's black brown. Um, the other one was black. So I thought, well, I don't colour my eyebrows in black anyway. So that's going to be too dark for my face. So I thought, okay, black brown might be the best thing. So, before I opened it, I actually went to Boots and saw that they actually had a stall with all the different colours and stuff. So I thought, right, let me see what it is before I open it. Or what the colours are like before I open it. Open it now, put my black brown colour on my hand. These times it's coming out grey. And I thought, oh, I've actually bought that colour. Then I saw Auburn and I thought, oh, Auburn's a bit more, it's, it's more brown which is what I wanted. Cut a long story short, I thought, right, I've got to go her get home and try this. So even though it's already opened, I've only tried it on my hand, so you guys will be experiencing this with me. So from the looks of things, it looks kind of like a, like a, like a gel. Like a gel consistency. I mean, it's not like mascara, but it's like, it's like watery, it's like watery lip gloss. Yeah, it's like watery lip gloss. I mean, I don't know if you can see that colour, I mean, it's a bit muddy. So we're going to see how it looks. Um, oh, I forgot to mention that it also comes with a little, um, little brow thingy. Like a, yeah, a little brow thing. Um, I guess that's for the front. See, I'm so used to doing my eyebrows like a block, and every time I meet my cousin, she's like, why have you got flipping slugs on your face? I'm like, leave my slugs alone. I love my slugs. But yeah, that's just the one, that's just the type of style that I think suits me. But let's give this a go. We're gonna try it and see how we get, we get, we get. Don't watch my big forehead. I've got a massive forehead, y'all. Right, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to dip this in, I think. I'm going to dip it in like so. It's 
moving it around a little bit. Oh shit. Oh, and I also, um, oh yeah, guys, and I also bought this from Primark, which is a dual kind of brush thing, which is kind of like half brush, half angled brush type thing. So, yeah, let's get started. I feel a bit like Wolverine still. Look. Right, and I need to put some shape in this. There's just like, yeah. I'm just lightly brushing this. Come on. Oh, I'm wiping off my foundation. But I'm gonna cover that with foundation um concealer. Then I'm use my angle brush. I kind of like it. Okay, look, I think where you have the hair, it seems to like fill up where you have hair, but where you don't have hair, it's like, it's not helpful because I've gone over that bit like three, four times and it's not taking it. So let's try the other brow. Hmm. Can't get the... Okay, for someone who's used to really, really heavy eyebrows, it's it's not that bad. Like, it's actually not that bad. A lot better than I thought. I actually like it, you guys. But the bits where you've got no hair, that's the only place, that's the only place where it's a bit difficult. Oh, uh, you should put more in it. Me talking to myself, crazy. I like it. Yo, to have eyebrows like these and then not transfer. Oh my god, where's that light though? Look at that light. Oi. I like it. Oh no, too close. Oi. Right, concealer. Concealer, concealer. Do you concealer? Like the best concealer I've ever got in my life. I'm not even lying to you. Like I'm used to, I don't know if you've seen a few of my other videos. Um, the concealers that I'm used to are like, for like three quid, like down the road. Like I need to treat my skin a lot better. Okay, just to mention you guys that my eyebrows haven't been plucked, threaded or shaped in the past two years. So my eyebrows are that thin, I can get away with it, but looking at these, I can still carry on without plucking them because they look all my days. 
I'm so happy right now. I'm proper happy. These are nice. The only thing is, I can't go like as sharp as I'd like to here because it's so like liquidy. But I think like you can just go over it once it's dried type of thing. You guys, I think my eyebrow game has like stepped up levels. Not even gonna lie. Oh my days. These look banging. Oh my. Oh my days. Go rub in this foundation quickly. Rub in the concealer, concealer. So guys, that was me doing my Wonder Brow. I did it in about, what, five minutes, if that. And if you look at them, look how natural they look. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Use that. I'm used to them being so heavy. And I'm surprised I put so much on and it still just looks really natural. Oh, I'm happy with these, you saw. <sighs> yeah. This is the one, right? If you've got bushy eyebrows, no eyebrows, this is the one. Oh my gosh. Okay, I can't say for no eyebrows because I don't have no eyebrows and that'd be a bit wrong of me to say, yeah, it works for um, people that don't have any eyebrows. But in the places where I have patches, it seemed to fill it quite well. And because it's in a liquid form, I think... Once it dries, you reapply, but obviously you don't put too much because then it will look a bit heavy. But these are just, yeah, I think I've changed my, um, yeah, my eyebrow game car. I'm loving this, loving this. So as you can see guys, this is obviously been a success. Wonder Brow does what it says on the packet. Um, later on I'll check to see whether it's waterproof or transfer proof. I'm gonna let this dry for like 20 minutes. Um, it's already started to dry. I've just put concealer around the edges to make it pop a little bit more, to give it a bit more shape. But I'm really happy with it. It's better than I thought because you know when you look at bad reviews and it kind of just puts you off, but I'm really, really happy with this. It's just a question of how long it's going to last, I think. Yeah. I don't know if I'm going to use this again. Oh my God. Sleek. Like, this has been my rider there, but like, this is like, trumped it. I'm sorry. This has trumped it. This is my new love. <gasps> yeah. Okay, thank you so much guys for watching my um, little demo and my review on um, Wonderbrow uh, Cosmetics, uh, the Wonderbrow Eyebrow Gel. Uh, so guys, make sure you like, comment or subscribe. Let me know if you liked how this looks on me. Let me know if you're thinking to buy and what colour you should have. I can definitely help you because obviously um, guys with like my skin complexion, I can say, yeah, this is definitely the one for you or if you want to go for the more like darker eyebrows or black or whatever get jet black but yeah if you want to know anything please comment down below let me know what you think like i just said um yeah and like and subscribe um to see more of my videos um so yeah see you in the next one bye